Okay, folks, this is Mick again, and I'm back with another unboxing. Um, this is my second one today, well, based on whatever order you're watching it. Maybe it's your first, or maybe it's the third one. Um, I got picked up a bunch of grab blocks when I was registering for a sci-fi block for three months. Um, hall block, we opened up, good stuff. This is my first time ever doing the straight up regular node block. Who knows, might like it, might not. I, as always, it is sealed. I do like to do it via mystery. Ooh. Makes it a lot more fun. And my partner will be doing one himself in a little while, so let's hope he will put himself with the knife. So put it Can you do it blind? Because last time I just blindly stuck my hand through a hole. Let's see what we got. Okay, we got a hard box, another box, maybe another vinyl figure of sorts, t shirt. Okay. Okay, well, we're going to have to yank stuff out because it's a lot. This feels like, huh, I don't know what this feels like. Molded a mug, okay, um, of, okay. Marvel. It's cool. Again, folks, if you haven't, I'm going to slice it open. If you haven't been watching our videos, we do have a pretty neat contest coming that will have a lot of goodies. Um, some of them we talked about, some of them will be surprises. Once we hit the old 75 subscriber mark, it will be a go. But let's open, let's see what this is. Mm. It, it is, I know what it is, because it tells you what it is. We got a, a mini mug. I guess this is for when you have like the addiction to coffee, but you only get to have a little bit of it. Um, Captain America. Yeah, espresso cup, I suppose. Mm. You know, there okay, you go. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to drink out of the head. Or I, I know he was Captain Italian. Captain America, now you get a chance. And folks, this, I like coffee, I have a much, much bigger vessel, so this will definitely be something that will pop up in a giveaway. Okay, sure. I'm going to put that away, though. You can get your, your final justice in the morning with your coffee, huh? Okay, so we'll put that off to the side and see what, through the box, to the t-shirt, I want to save the box and t-shirt to the way. Okay, we got something, almost feels like pencils and a waiter, which I hope not, but who knows. Okay, we got an action figure. Um, uh, you know what? I, I can live with this. I do, I'm not that big on Firefly. I know there were some wait, wait, wait. nerd fans out there who will be upset me saying that. I just haven't had a chance to check it out. However, I do am a fan of the main character, whose name I can't think of now, um, because he's made a ton of other stuff. He was in Castle. I liked him that. He was the evil guy in the last season of Buffy. So if I had to get one of these characters, and I do have a ton of reaction figures, mainly the horror ones and Pulp Fiction, um, I will hang this up with the rest of them in my house. Very, very cool. I can't think of the actor's name. I'm sorry. I'm sure he's heartbroken over that. I can't, I'm trying to remember the theme song. Okay, now this, this feels like batteries. Maybe if I, let's see. No? Okay. Okay, etch a, etch a sketch sticky notes? I don't know, I'm, I guess it's just regular, regular, regular sticky notes. You know what, I'll, I will put it on my desk, it's a little different, what the hell, you know, we all have to write stuff down, phone numbers, etc. Okay, I forget this is nerd block and not hollow block, so I'm opening it, I'm like, oh, okay, that's why. I guess nerds love the etch a sketch. Let's see what this is, here's a bigger box, it's not super heavy. Probably a plastic figure, a Funko type figure. Let's see what we got. Oh, okay. Oh, you know what? It's a Titans figure, and it's of Ecto-1, and this is awesome. One, because it is a, it's a node block exclusive, which is always cool. You know, look at this. So far, this is 10 bucks. Everything here, that's not bad at all. Um, even if you're being cautious of what you would pay for this stuff. You know, like even, you know, that's that's a really good va value. Plus, not to start the fight of which Ghostbusters movie I hated or which Ghostbusters movie I loved. Um, if you've listened to our podcast on Cape Crusaders, you know which one that is. This is the original Ecto-1. Good, so it's the one without... If you look on the side, if you look on the side, you see who else is advertised there. So this is some... I like this show, a lot. Show the side again. I like this a lot. This will go, um, again, as we set up the hall room, uh, this is definitely going to go in there with some of the 
I actually have most of the Ghostbusters pops, with the exception of Egon. For those of you who like Egon, no, Egon is expensive. Um, blind with feeling around the box. I think, uh, no, there might be a print. So I don't want to peel off the print, so I'm going to use the t-shirt first. Let's see what we got as a t-shirt. Okay, I... Huh. I don't know. Um, Fox, you're a little more nerdy than me. Um, does this well, let me speak to you as anything? In and, uh, I mean, uh, is it a prey off like the Suicide Squad stuff, maybe? Uh, could, that, could that be something, you know, Hulk like, Quinn or Joker did? Guess you would kill yourself out of boredom. That could be a, an excuse. <laughs> No, but is that what that looks like to you? Do you, do you recognize it from anywhere else? I actually, I don't. Do you, I do you know the reference? Um, maybe it's just because, like, smiley faces and their old memorabilia. Like, oh. you know, or, like, t-shirts that have, like, t-shirts with writing on them, like, Fox always wears. Maybe. I am an like, amazing French I think I think it's probably trying to connect with some sense of Suicide Squad without having to pay money. Hmm. Um, Still nice shirt. But I like it. Yeah, it's a black shirt. Too. That's the material. Feels not like that. Not that yet, not that. No, no. Well, I will say this: these companies, um, some a little better than others, but everyone I've got from Noteblock, consistently wise, is pretty good, pretty comfortable. And the print, which I got to turn around this way to look at, wow, the print I love. I love the print. What's your favorite Mel Brooks movie? Blazing Saddles. Good, good, good choice. Mine is. Baseballs. Okay, okay. That's pretty neat, right? Yeah, may the Schwartz be with you. And may, the Schwartz, yeah. may the Schwartz be with you. What kind of idiots luggage combinations? One, two, three, four. <laughs> I do. I, I think that's very, very cool. Um, and again, same thing. Not going to show the code, so don't zoom in. Another $10 credit. So I paid $10 for this box. I, even if you're being conservative and you want to say, that's a $5 t-shirt. This is a Five dollar figure, five dollar mug, five dollar. Not bad. And what? I actually think this is pretty cool since it is an exclusive. One of these days, I'm gonna get that code on camera. I'm gonna. He was he was too quick that time. One of these days. Yeah. Okay, folks, that's it for this episode. Again, is me. Lots of things to look at down below. Remember, once we hit seventy five, we got the contest going. For sure, the Captain America thing is in there. Eh, who knows? Maybe I do Paul with Ecto one. I don't know. Folks, check us out again.